We couldn't have the walk two years in a row because of COVID. So we're back in person and we're delighted. We had a really good crowd here today. A walk to stop hate returned tonight after two years of virtual walks. Welcome in. I'm Russell Colburn. Tonight's walk kicks off the seven days event. A movement started following the deadly mass shooting at the Jewish community centers in Overland Park eight years ago. Fox 4's Monica Castro was at tonight's walk at the World War I Memorial. Hundreds put on their walking shoes and showed up on the lawn of the World War I Memorial this evening. The message tonight to spread kindness. Find a reason and a purpose to be kind, not to be hateful, but to be kind. Seven days got started after Mindy Corcoran and her family experienced the unthinkable tragedy. This started in April of 2014 when a hate crime happened. My dad and son were murdered and so was Terry Lomano and our community rallied together. The victims, 14-year-old Rhett Underwood, his grandfather, Dr. William Corporan, and 53-year-old Terry Lomano. After two years of virtual walks, Corporan is happy to see the support in person again. If you did not get a chance to walk with us, you can walk on your own. You can walk on your own. You can choose to do kind actions on your own. Monica Castro, Fox 4, working for you.